Hi all, and this is your girl Natasha, and I'm serving a little tea, and I'm going to do, and I'm going to throw in my favorite Milano cookie, but with my diabetes I've been eating less, so I have more to serve to you children instead of eating it all up myself. <laughs> Anyway, darling, I saw that ZT, that short little video she made about buying views. Girl, if you don't go somewhere and get your nursing license, you better. You know, ZT, you're always making videos and it's an echo or something. I think that you're somewhere, you know, you're a CNA, you're no nurse. And I'm not knocking CNAs, but you should, you're always somewhere where the nurses aren't. Don't they have nursing stations? Don't they have nursing lounges? You're never in one of those. It's always an echo where you are. And you don't, it doesn't sound like hospital tea. And I was in the hospital over the summer. You just don't give hospital effects when you're, when you're talking, and I see you have to get off the, um, stop making your video. Mm-hmm. They called you. Patient needs a clean up in room 237. But I'm not going to make fun of sick patients. I'm just coming for you. Buying views. Bitch, you'll do anything to buy a view. The nerve of you. Yeah, I'm inserting myself because I can't stand you. And every time I see you up there playing nurse, you're a fraud. You're a fraud, a nurse. What nursing school have you been to? I didn't see a degree up on your wall. From what university and what nursing school were you in? What nursing school even accepted you? Darling, you have to take tests. <laughs> And you have to be interviewed to be into nursing school. I don't, I don't see it for you, no, ZT. You're a plain old typical sissy. You're always coming for the LGBT community and you're the biggest fag there ever was. And yet you don't want to be associated? Girl, I don't want you associated. Oh, these queens kill me. And as it goes for the hormones, I just want to add one thing. Miss Treasure did the cleanup. And she read Chopper about the hormones, which of course it tugs at me because I'm full of estrogen. Now, I remember Chopper saying, and maybe I shouldn't get into it, but I remember Chopper saying she was transitioning, what, a year or two ago? I really don't watch her. If she was on hormones, she would be Full of estrogen. She would be softer looking. She would be more feminine, ladylike. I mean, she's not on estrogen. I would love. There was one thing that I was hoping Miss Treasure would ask. It's what a chopper, what is your testosterone level? When you're on hormones, has your testosterone level gone down? And how far down did they go? And where are they? Then that way I could tell if you were really on hormones. I hate children talking about their trance and not on lying about they're not on a moan the first. Yes, you can feel trance and you don't have to be on hormones or whatever. That I'm not disputing. But if you lie, as you blatantly did, and said that you were on hormones and you were transitioning and two years has passed and you and nothing, you're still dressing like a man. You're still looking. Nothing's changed. You're not on hormones, you're lying. And this is what I'm talking about, about the LGBT community. When we're going to go fight for something or fight for rights, let us have it together. And I'm talking particularly to my black LGBT 
community, some of us, can be the biggest liars in the world and they make it look bad for us. You know it's prejudice in the LGBT community. You know the Caucasian children look down on us, some of them. And then we sit up in line, talk about we're trans, playing around with that word. And yet we're in society trying to fight for rights. But then we have other people around bullshitting. Makes us look stupid. Even on YouTube, I don't care if it's the beef sector or not. If you're going to be something, be it. If you're thinking about it, oh well. I'm not going to come for your help, chopper. I have no reason to. But I can say this, with your help, and I heard you had a colonoscopy bag, Tasha, get a Say it right. That you would be watched especially close on hormones. Because hormones do, they have to watch your kidneys and things of that nature when you are on hormones. Yes, if you're under a doctor who is giving you the proper care, they check for all of that. And to just throw around your own hormones, I think that you're making fun of the LGBT, com the trans community. And we're not taking serious the T in the LGBT, such as that ZT, who claims he can't stand transgender and drag queens. Girl, you might as well be one yourself. The whore that you are. Playing straight man, trying to get a man. I'll never forget, darling, when I had to put you in your place, girl, and show you how you snatch a man as a woman. Not playing man like you were, trying to get that service man when your heater broke down, girl. Oh, that was a cackle, girl. And he paid you no mind, by man, or something. Oh, that was a kick. And you could take it. When I had went to the store, sitting down, talking to that lovely delivery man, delivering beer. Do you remember that, ZD? Mm, I will remember it well. Then I have to show you again. When I had the cable man in here fixing the internet. And we were chatting. And I was presented as the woman that I am. Mm-hmm. You remember that, bitch. Like I said, you're always somewhere. I can tell when you're not, when you're at work and you're hiding. Because you never show yourself. No, you're not going to show what you do. I never see a nurse's tag on you anything. No. Mm -mm. No, you're not a nurse. I didn't mean to insert myself, but it's just that when I hear about these lying ass queens talk about they on hormones and they not trans the first. It just goes through me because we are going through a lot fighting transgender people for their right, our rights. And charity begins at home. Charity begins at home. And that's why I have to say something. Anyway, that's all I had to say. I saw that ZT. And I laughed when he got off that video. Somebody came and caught you, girl. Or they caught you on, on room 237. Come clean up. Mm -hmm. I don't make fun of the sick. But it's just funny how a nurse never is in the nursing lounge or at her desk. It doesn't have to show the name of the hospital, girl. It's just your tea. <laughs> the tea you're serving is old, girl. Throw it out and get fresh tea, girl. <laughs> Anyway, let me stop acting stupid. I just had to throw that read out. I couldn't help it. 
Because I hate when these sissies lie, talk about they want hormones, and they're doing this, and they're doing that. And two years later, they look exactly the same. I mean, hormones aren't a magic. They aren't magic, but you could tell if you were on hormones. You could tell something. Anyway, all I just had to say that when I saw that ZG. And I heard Chopper. Chopper, why are you always chopping the videos down after you make them? Stand in your shit. If you're going to be a fab, shady sissy, then stand into it. Like I said, I, I'm, I'm just making an observation. I'm not getting to, into any beefs or anything. That's not what I'm here for. Well, it's just that when I heard hormones, I don't know. It's just something I have to say. I get tired of, I'm taking hormones. I'm transitioning. And a hundred years later, it doesn't look like you've taken a thing. <laughs> Tasha, knock it off. Bad Tasha. Anyway, all, I hope you've enjoyed my little snacks and tea. And until the next time, I will be back. I love you all. And ZT, girl, like I said, oh yeah, by the way, is your niece still obese? Is she still big as all outdoors? The one that was on that block for 2013. I'll never forget that picture as long as I live. I bet she's bigger than that girl. Any old way. <laughs> Let me go. I've had enough fun reading. Anyway, all, I should be back. I love you all and take care. Mwah.